Welcome back, folks. Manic Sonic here for the next part of my Pokemon Brown Let's Play. Uh, in the last part, we start, we beat uh, most of the trainers in the, I think it's New Shore City Gym. So yeah, and we're going to face the gym leader. However, there's something I'd like to address first. Um, well, a couple things, actually. First thing is, I um, got a message uh, yesterday from um, an IWSS13. I don't know how to pronounce that username. That's why I'm just giving you the letters and the numbers. I'll probably put a link. I'll put a link in the description, which will probably be below you now, if you, because everyone's probably got that new stupid video display page thing. But anyways, yeah. Um. So yeah, I don't know if it actually changed the colors at all, but basically, what uh, he said to do was to go to the GBA and se select uh, SGB, the Game Boy, and go to SGB. Uh, to get colors. I don't see he really, really did anything. Maybe I missed a step. I don't know. Uh, other person, um, my friend uh, Kyle has helped me before and we would have set it to real colors as well. However, as you can see that just is this which doesn't make colors and really just sort of destroys it in my opinion. I think the other way looked a little better so um if I'm missing something, I'm 100% sure. I know I could. It might be I have to reset first. Let's try that. But I've tried that before. It doesn't appear to do anything. So, um, if you've played this hack or you know how to make uh, it colored, uh, let me know and I'll try again in the future. But for now, I'm going to leave it on the, the uh, SGB. Hopefully, that's um, somewhat better for you. Um, Next thing I want to address is uh, if anyone's been following the news about Pokemon Prism, I, I know this is a big news thing at the beginning, but there's some things I want to mention. Uh, anyone following Pokemon Prism, uh, there has been, I don't know, I guess you could say it's a leak in a sense um, of the Beta 3, which I don't know if that's even the complete version by a YouTuber who K Cool Boy Man sent it to, but said specifically not to re release the patch. I don't know if that, the do not release was like, um, uh, April Fool's Day or something joke because it was yesterday and everyone was doing April Fool's yesterday. Well, except me. But anyways, yeah, I'm not going to uh, download the pat the uh, third patch. I'm going to wait to make sure it's it was an April f to make sure that he wants it released. If Cool Boy Man doesn't want it to release anyone but the person he sent it to, I'm not going to take download it and I'm not going to use it. That means it will not be a Prism Let's Play until it's made public. Uh, just I know it's there, but. I don't want to because then it's not fair. I want to be fair to Cool Boy Man. He made the hacks. He doesn't want other people playing it. I'm not going to do that. Um, yeah, but that's really all I want to mention. So, um, yeah, we can start facing her now. Uh, Cheryl. Ah, I couldn't remember what her name was. Cheryl. That's a nice name. I use my psychic powers to maximum extent. Arca. Psy badge. <laughs> makes sense. That means she'll probably have Kadabas and Abersos makes sense because they're the Psy Pokemon, so. Oh, okay. She didn't use a Starmin in any of those games. However, this is really bad for me since I started out with Krega. Um, it's probably got water moves, too. So I'll switch her to Undine for this fight. And I'm a little bit underleveled, so uh, we may have a little bit of problems here. We'll have to wait and see, though. Um, and as I mentioned before, um... As you can, well, as obviously you've all noticed, we have a new YouTube page, um, video page. Um, this is not new to me, actually. I had this happen about a month ago, and then they took it down, and I don't like it any more now than I did then. <laughs> it's really stupid. The whole, I, I like how the whole rating system might have been taken down, because they, like they said, there had been some problems with it in the past. But the new like system... Well, they haven't changed it on your video page, so when I go to see what rating I have, I have to go to each video, or it just tells me five star or not. So I don't know um, if I if what if people actually how many people actually like or dislike my videos, which I like to know actually, because then I can try to change things. I already know I should try to change my commentary a little bit, make it a little bit more entertaining. That's been mentioned before, and I'm gonna try to work on that. But um, yeah, I don't, I, I don't think anyone really likes a new YouTube page. It's, it wouldn't be the first time. Every, recently, everything that's been changed, really, everyone's got problems with. But uh, not much I can do about it. It's there. It's not horrible, I guess. Um, it's a little more. It's a little annoying with the whole comment thing and all comments being changed and all that. But like, but uh, not important. Um, I should probably comment about this trainer, gym leader. She hasn't used any Pokemon she actually used in the uh, original game, except Alexam here. 
Um, I'm gonna keep Craig out for this. And man, that's a messed up Alakazam sprite. I, I know Alakazam is pretty skinny, but that he looks anorexic there. <laughs> oh, you know what? Actually, using flamethrower might have been a bad idea. It has a pretty good physical special defense. Let's see what happens if I use Metal Claw. Let's see if that does it anymore. And hopefully, it, Psychic doesn't KO. Ow! That did quite a bit of damage, though. Um, oh, I'm better off to use Flamethrower, actually. And I speed, sped it again, and oh, <laughs> oh, oh, I was one hit away, and then I had to go and use Hyper Potion. Uh, oh, Craig is going to faint here. Um, let's see, I'll switch out to Undine. Uh, hopefully this doesn't KO or bite all really I have, though with that reflect up it's going to make things a little bit more difficult. Um, uh, let's see, come on, survive, 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 yes, she just survived. And while it might be a little bit of a waste, I'm going to use a hyper potion myself. Just to make sure she survives. Um, I know Undine's a little over leveled compared to the rest of my team now, but I'll deal with training the others any later. And it's not like I could really do anything with, um, uh, what's just, uh, Hitmonlee here, uh, Robin Dam here, anyways. Uh, Undine, uh, all my Pokemon except him are, are okay against Psychic, but he's super weak again. Oh, uh, super weak, he's just weak against Psychic moves, so. Um, Psy Badge, and 70. TM, Psy Wave most likely. If it's like the original game. And if it's not Psychic, then it's not the most powerful Psychic move ever. Because Psychic is, to my knowledge, still the most powerful Psychic move in existence. Well, except for certain ones. Psychic, Psycho Cutter is better for some if it's a physical. Oh, it's actually Psychic in this game. Huh. I guess he got rid of Psy Wave. Psy Wave is usually what you get, and that's far from the wor best Psychic move ever. It's probably the worst, actually. Hmm, I wonder if you can actually get into wild battles in this water. If it is, this would be the first, one of the only gyms you can get wild encounters in. Oh, I want to show you something. When you choose Surf, it says no surfing on Dean here. That's sort of funny. Or in my opinion, anyway, it's sort of funny because in the other games it just says uh, it's not there's a time and place for everything. At least to my knowledge, anyways. But it's been a while. Um, yeah. As for what we're gonna be doing next, uh, I'll show you the town map after we go heal. <laughs> yeah, I guess if you did have psychic powers, you could make a bundle at the slots. But um, yeah, that's surprising. It wasn't hard to find the gym leader. My friend Kyle had problems with that, and I thought there might be some kind of trick to it, but. Um, guess there isn't. Um, uh, I, t I think I may have taken a little bit of too much time at the beginning to discuss things, but we beat the gym later. I guess that's a little bit of progress. And I'm going to basically explain to you what's going to be, n where we're going to be going next, and how the game's going to work now. Um, oh yeah, I should probably show you. We have two gym ba badges left. Seven and eight. And if I go up here, oh yeah, psychic will go in the box, because I might use that in the future. Let's go to the town map. Uh, as you can see, we only have one city we have not actually explored yet. Let me get to it. And that is right here, Igaloo City. Um, however, so uh, I don't know what the last gym is going to be. I don't know. Maybe in Azalea Town is one of that gym is actually one of the gyms you actually face. I don't quite know. Um, as for um, what's going to happen next? I'm going to head to Igaloo City as it's the only city we haven't actually explored yet in the region. region. Uh, that's probably where we'll go next time. But as you can see, there's other ra water routes here. There are quite a few water routes. Um, so, uh, we'll probably go back and I'll explore each of the routes eventually. See if there's like caves, dungeons, items, traders. Uh, I don't know when I'll do that, if I'll do that like after I beat the uh, league, or if I'll do it before I beat the league, after I beat all the gyms, or, or in between the 7th and 8th gym, I, or I'll split it up. I haven't decided yet, but next time we'll be going to Eagle City. Uh, as the 